Hey there, and welcome back to Virtual Cheese Emporium. It is currently 6.30. Oh my god, it's 6.30. But today is the day of my graduation! Yay! I'm just sad I have to wake up this early in order to have it, but I get to have a graduation, like I said, so I am very grateful, but ugh, the sun's barely up. I'm tired. I could barely sleep, and that sucks. But I'm up, and so I need to get my day started. So, let's do that! Today's gonna be the usual fare, you know, basically what I did yesterday. Get up, get dressed, put on makeup, get shoes, eat, get my hair done, <laughs> and everything else necessary in order to get prepped, pampered, and ready to go to a formal event. So, let's go through the whole routine, once again, only with a different dress, different makeup, and for an entirely different reason. Okay, everybody, let's get going. Get ready for yet another Getting Ready With Me montage. We have the dress, the cape, the cap, the jewels, and the shoes. And in a few seconds, if I time this right, you will see me in all of it. And here I am in my gorgeous pink dress. Just thought you'd like to see it before it's covered up by that gown. Now time for makeup. We're going super simple because I don't care and I am way too tired for this. And now to secure the cap on my head. This took a long time, but eventually we got it down. Aww, and look at me. Here I am in all of my beautiful duds, ready to sit in the hot sun and get a diploma. Alright everyone, as you can see, I am dressed, primped, and ready to go. All we need to do is head in the car, and in a few hours I will officially be... <laughs> a high school graduate. Alright, now we are actually late, so we do really need to go now. Alright, let's get in the car! There I am! I'm walking in the pink bunny mask right about now. And here is a compilation of the first of many photo shoots that will happen throughout this video. Hey, so I graduated and it was pretty normal. It wasn't like a big fanfare or anything, but I did it. <laughs> I can officially go to college. I'm getting sweaty, the air conditioning is on, which might explain for the rumbling in the background, and the tassel is swept to play with. <laughs> but yeah, I'm about to head home because I am sticky, and sticky is not a good thing to be. <laughs> Especially when you are not supposed to be sticky in the first place. So, I'm gonna head home, I'm going to take a very sticky nap, and then we're gonna go on about our day. Time to show off my graduation presents because I have family members who love me and love to support me. As you can see, lots of cards, lots of very pretty envelopes from good friends and family. Oh, and look what we have there. We have an adorable little teddy bear card. That was from my mom. And this was a present that I got for myself. Since I'm subscribed to Book of the Month, I got myself a few books from their June collection. Who knows, maybe one of these books will be on my next book list video. It's Father's Day everyone! Here's a little gift that I got for him along with some money because I love him. 
as you can tell by the videos of the clothes and the shoes, we're going to be going somewhere today. But where exactly are we headed? Well, I will tell you after this little beauty montage of me showing off my gorgeous face. Today we're headed off to Baltimore! And why are we there in Baltimore? Because it's a cool city! And we're there to do a graduation photo shoot that is two weeks too late. But we're doing it anyway since we didn't get to do it after graduation. That nap was very sticky and took like eight hours. So yeah, we weren't going to go to Baltimore that day. But we're here now and it's going to be great. But before photos, it's eating time. I got myself some chicken and waffles. The chicken was nasty, but the waffles and peach tea that I got were really good. So it pretty much evened out. And now, throughout this video, you shall see me moving throughout Baltimore and taking beautiful pictures of myself. Well, my dad's taking pictures of me. But still, I will be in the picture and you shall look at me. Please enjoy the montage. Hello everyone, I'm currently walking through Baltimore trying to find another place to take a picture. Uh, there's currently some problems with my, my neck shadow, as you can see right here, so it's getting a little bit difficult to find an optimal photo shoot spot, but at least we're near the harbor. That's pretty. Okay, so we're gonna keep getting our exercise, and soon we're gonna find a place to take really nice photos. This was my favorite picture location. I mean, look at the fountain. Absolutely gorgeous. Hey everyone. We are walking back after a long time of walking, taking pictures and being out in the slightly horrible but very beneficial hot sun. <sighs> We're done for now. We're gonna rest in the car, eat more of our food, probably. And for me, I'm gonna be drinking my peach tea in the shade. <laughs> and we're not gonna take any more pictures until Dad feeds the meter and we can go out again. <laughs> oh, this is Valerie, by the way. I introduced the parasol in the first part. <laughs> All right, let's go back to the car. Alright everyone, we are done with pictures and we are slowly winding down. But there is one place that the entire family would like to go before we go back home and hit the hay. Because once again, very sticky, very hot day. And here we are walking, enjoying the scenery, enjoying the music that you can't hear. I also took I also took videos of lots of flowers because flowers are pretty and I like flowers. And if I time this right, I think we are going to be approaching our destination. Haha! I think we are here. Welcome to the Sound Garden, a beautiful music shop cloistered in the urban part of Baltimore. Here in this lovely shop, you can satisfy all of your vinyl and movie needs. There was a lot of seasons of anime that I could have gotten, but I'm cheap, so I didn't get any at all. 
but once we go back, I'm gonna get some money and I'm gonna buy everything that I can and watch them all in one day because that's what weebs do. Well, everyone, it is about that time. Everybody is tired, especially me because I tire very easily. <laughs> So we are heading back home. We're gonna head back home. 45 minutes to home. I'm sorry, I'm tired. I can't make out sentences. But today was a really good day. I think Dad had a good time. Mom had a good time. And I had a good time. The sun was brutal, but the food was good. The roads are clear. And yeah, today was a good day. Time for us to be off, everybody. It was a really hot and sticky day, but I really did have a good time, and I had lots of fun with my family. And you know what you do after you've had lots of fun with your family in a city that you like? Well, the answer is, you go home to a dinner of chili dogs and watermelon, you find some time to perfect and actually finish your father's Father's Day present, and you settle down and watch a little movie called Love and Monsters and thoroughly enjoy the entire experience. I hope you had a good Father's Day, Dad. I love you! Alright everyone, that's what I did on Father's Day and my graduation. Graduation sucked, honestly. It was way too hot, the polyester cape was terrible, the cicadas decided to have a party all, all, all over the field and on my foot too, so yeah, graduation was awful. But I had one, which was good, which I need to be grateful for, but it still was... no. But Father's Day was actually really fun, though. I had the graduation photo shoot, as you obviously saw, and Dad had a really good time with us. My dad has been working his butt off, trying to support the family and everything along with my mom, so it is really good to have Father's Day where he can just chill out, spend the day with us in Baltimore, and just have some fun with his family. So, I hope you enjoyed your day, Dad. Well, at least you said you did, but I really hope you did, and I love you. And thank you all to the people who decided to watch this video on what we did to celebrate our dad's, my dad, my dad, he's my dad, <laughs> my dad's special day. Thank you all for coming back to my 20s Emporium, and I hope to see you all again very, very soon. Alright, you appreciate your dads, everybody, and to everyone, have a wonderful day. Bye!